Okay. Here we go. This is where the magic happens. Today we are making some stuff in the shop. And got some fun ways of doing stuff that, uh, you know, a couple techniques really opens the doors. So here we are, we're bending some aluminum. That's a meaty chunk. Now I want to get a 90 degree bend out of this puppy. That's like a five centimeter wide, two inch wide piece of aluminum, about three mils thick. And if you try and bend it all the way to 90 degrees in one shot, in one spot, it's just gonna snap in half. And uh, now this, you know, tell you how smart I am. It took me a while to come up with this, but I just figured 45 plus 45 equals 90. So I make two bends pretty close together. And uh, that's what I call working with what you got. Looks like I bent it a little too far, so I'm now unbending it. And then I just kind of file away, and that's, uh, I'm just checking the metal to see if it cracked. I've actually never bent such a, you know, wide piece of metal in this, uh, that little break before, so I didn't know how it would do, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's, uh, pretty solid. So... That'll do you. Now you've got a 90 degree bend. Okay, we've got our bend. Now let's cut off the chunk we want. Hacksaw, nothing fancy. Wish I had a better saw, but uh, what can you do? There we go. Coming along. Just a rough cut for now to get it kind of close to the final dimension. I don't know exactly, this is a new thing that I'm making, so I don't really have a pattern that I'm working off. I'm just kind of doing it and making it work. So this is gonna be a two axis mount for uh, the gimbal, and I'm hoping I can just tape this against the roof of the car, and uh, that might be easier. So, okay, here we are working off the pattern. So uh, yeah, my Facebook group, I post some of these patterns, it's called FPV Builders Group, something like that, I'll post it below. But uh, yeah, I produce these patterns in CAD and uh, just uh, start off just kind of making a hole and then I'll tape that down. I find if you make a hole with the pin first and then uh, tape it in your spot and then use a center punch. Your center punch, you can feel where that hole is from the pin and you start to get, you know, like pretty good precision. So center punch, if you don't use a center punch, your drill bit's just gonna wander all over the place. You'll never get the holes anywhere, even close to where you need them. So this is a new addition. This is the, the uh, tap and die set. So I'm just checking uh, there what drill bit size I need for an M3 hole. Metric tap and die set, that's what you need. And we take her over to the drill press. Drill away, that's a little bit of cutting fluid there. I know, it's it's super fast. Like, I can't actually, like I don't hardly know how to do this stuff. I can't teach anyone else. <laughs> you know, I'm just showing you how it's done for further investigation, you know? There must be like a drill press channel on YouTube that can teach us all some good stuff, but yeah, this has been working. So, uh, holes are made, tap and die. Which one's a tap, which one's a die? That's what I'd like to know. And this will cut threads, so then you can screw stuff down to it. So I've got some little plastic standoffs um, from Amazon or whatever marketplace. We're gonna put those in these after this and mount Storm 32 to it. Two, 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 two it. Storm 32, two, two, two it. There we go. Try not to make a mess. Tip of the day, don't make a mess. But yeah, these, you know, a couple little techniques. Maybe I'll go over plastic, um, how I make my plastic bits. 
which is pretty much the same as far as the patterns go and the drill and tap goes, but the cutting is, uh, is a little bit different. But between bending aluminum and making parts out of plastic and tapping and dyeing stuff, you can get a long way building building stuff for RC cars. So, yeah, there we go. Board's mounted. Still got to drill the holes for the uh, gimbal motor and mount that up. Get it all wired, tape it in place, drive it till uh, you know till something breaks. I guess I don't know. All right, we'll catch you next time. Jupiter RC out.